scientific calculator with a fraction key can be a great help when reducing fractions to lowest terms. I'm going to start with the TI-30XA with a single line display. And let's try number one, 9 45ths. Usually we would have to figure out what number can be divided into each of the numerator and the denominator, but the fraction, the scientific calculator, will do that for us. 9 fraction key 45, press enter or equals, and it reduces for us to lowest terms. 1 -fifth is the same value as 9 45ths, but the numbers are as simple as possible. So we'll try number 5, 16, fraction key 18, press equals, and I'm reduced to 8 ninths. I have one extra problem in here that was not in your book. Um, let's see if the numbers that are this big can be handled on this calculator. 300, fraction key 1080, You'll notice I can't get that final zero to display, so any answer I get here will not be correct. You'll need to do this one on your own by hand as shown in the book. Let's now also look at the type of calculator with a slightly larger display, a two-line display, the TI-30X 2S, 9 fraction key 45, press equals, and it's reduced to 1 -fifth. It maintains what I typed in on the first line and gives me the answer in lowest terms on the second line. Number five, we have 16, fraction key 18, and reduces quickly to 8 ninths. Let's see if this one will handle numbers that are quite this big. 300, fraction key 1080, press enter, Yes, I reduced to 5 eighteenths. Um, if you get any much bigger, though, <laughs> it will not handle it. And so there is a limit to the size of the fractions you can use with the fraction key on these calculators.